Hello and welcome to Veritas Cluster Server Administration course. My name is Gurjab and I will be your instructor throughout this course. In this course, we will learn about high availability clustering in Linux using Veritas Cluster Server. In this introduction lecture, however, I will talk about what you will learn throughout the course and what are the requirements from you to follow along. In this course, we will talk about server clustering, cluster types and failover mechanisms. Then we will move forward to Veritas Cluster Server and its architecture. We will thoroughly discuss physical and logical components of VCS. Next, we will install and configure a two-node Veritas Cluster in which we will deploy a resilient application. Once everything is in place, then we will do a failover testing. I will briefly explain failover versus switchover in VCS terminology. You don't have to have a prior knowledge of Veritas Cluster Server software However, it is desired that you have good basic understanding of Linux operating systems. We will be using CentOS 7 and Veritas 7.4.2 server software in this course. Don't worry, if you are just getting started with the Linux or with the VCS, I have got you covered. I will explain every command which we will type throughout this course. For hardware or software requirements, you must have a desktop or laptop PC with minimum 8 GB of RAM and 4 core processors. Your laptop can run any Windows, Mac or Linux operating system. However, you must install Oracle VirtualBox in order to continue. In the next lecture, we will talk about server clustering in general. I will see you in the next lecture then.